It is impossible to know when it started. This memory saved my consciousness. Some moments pop out of my thoughts like a timeline unfolding the events. They come as a rational explanation for our suffering, fulfilling my epistemic needs for meaning. Remember, you always trying to protect me as a child, yet you were often irritable and I could not get why no one could. I remember that we used to travel together in our shared dreams, always fighting many battles against ugliness of society, which we met so early. I remember something growing the distance among us, as if I felt completely disconnected from everyone, yet the link of Miras has always been transcendental. I remember realizing that whatever was wrong was serious. I was sleeping closer to the window and needed to be closer so I wouldn't be cold. As I fought for my interests, you fought for yours, and I had no idea that you needed to be open. The explosion of aggressiveness from your reaction was unexpected, and at that moment I could feel that it hit deep suffering. I filled with empathy and hug you. We both were in tears. Time passed and those explosions became part of our lives. Treatments were not sensible enough so you kept back and forth. One strategy adopted by me was to get physically distant. Yeah, my soul would always bring me back as in a spiral whenever you need me. My soul travels to meet you, as if I could help anyway. The ones who stayed have developed the strategies for it. Not my case. A simple misplacement of an object at home nowadays is enough to make you excessively irritable. Back in that moment, I have noticed that you are not the sick one, but am I? Or are we both? My body sweats cold, it shakes and interrupted. I can only hear my heart beating high and fast. I am so sure of the death arriving and the fear is incessant. I'm going to die. Everyone is going to. Still, I try to breathe. Nothing works. I look around and I see people quite normal in control. We are the only sick ones. You are altered by whatever silly event made you so, and I am altered because of you. You do not find resolution for a change you into someone else. You do not calm yourself. The fear of death will not leave me. All I want is to be far from it all. I pick my stuff, leave, I swear to myself, I will stay away to prevent these feelings. Until my dreams bring me back. My unconsciousness has a weird way of trying to solve it all. Everyone dies. When it happens, I can finally stay apart. Apart from all the suffering we have cultivated together. My panic attacks are led by fear of death, yet deep inside it appears solving the unsolvable and ending a chapter. Then I will start over.